Hi Here's guys, I'm back. It's Saturday. Just started our day. It's pretty late, it's five in the afternoon. But um, we're here at the mall because I need to get me something to wear for tomorrow. It's my mom's birthday, and it's, and I need to get her something. Which I don't know what I'm gonna get her. I was gonna come to Target early this morning because if you guys didn't know, the Hunter Rain Boots collection came out today. And I've always wanted some rain boots because it rains so much here in Florida. But I read online that the boots were very cheap, made of very cheap material. And on top of that, they didn't even come out with the boots that they were supposed to come out with. They were delayed. So, no boots. Let's see what they have here because apparently everybody was talking about everything was sold out. So, let's see what we find. It's kind of weird vlogging and and the store. <laughs> Target. I love Target. You come here and you come out with a hundred things that you don't need. Maybe do you feel um, weird that I'm vlogging? I don't know you. <laughs> You're walking next to me. I don't know you. So these are the kids' stuff. Oh, it's are so cute! For Victoria, when she could walk, how much are these? $25, not bad. I have these bags. I guess maybe you could put your boots in here. My husband's like, why do you need rain boots? Because when it rains, you're not gonna know when it rains and um, you're just gonna pull the boots out like how are you gonna have the boots you don't want these babe <laughs> some slides pointed it to the stuff They have, I wanted some, a rink, oh this, look, this is nice, I'll get something like this, maybe they're like, they're known for their rain boots, which are super expensive, but they came out, this is nice, look, when it rains, you have your raincoat, $45. Okay, you can have this one. Oh, they have the boot on. Oh, these are, I think these are the man boots. Oh, yeah, like I said, online they were people were saying they're cheap material. I'm not gonna get none of that. Thought I was, but I'm not. Just need something for tomorrow. It's gonna be an outside thing, and I know it's gonna be hot, so I just want something that I could wear and not be hot and these rompers are really in like the stripes rompers i really like i got a pair i got a set the other day at tj maxx and it was really nice i used to shop like crazy but now i kind of just shop when i need it like if i need something i'll go and get it like if, like now I'm looking for an outfit for my mom's birthday to wear. That's what I do now. So whenever I need it, I go and buy it instead of buying and just having it in the closet. Oh, this is cute. This is into. It's really cute, actually. I don't know if I would pair it together. I feel like it's too much. I don't even have my size anyways. But this is really cute. Target guys. Target has some nice stuff. Oh, this is cute. This is actually really cute. Okay. 
All right, guys, I'm gonna focus and try to find something and I'll be back. All right, guys, this is parents' worst nightmare. Yep, that's poop. Yep, what do you feel? So thank God we're at the family bathroom and we're gonna get this done. <laughs> My husband thought he was gonna get away, but we got family bathroom. All right guys, I don't know how to do this. Gosh, wait, okay. So first let me do this down here. Gosh, it's extremely hot at the mall. I don't know what's going on. Oh my God, Marshy, this is all over. Oh over her new dress too, look on the top. Everything, oh my gosh. Help me get stuff on the Do you have to change your clothes? Yeah. It's not funny, Marshy, I'm sorry. Oh, thank God I didn't go that all the way to the... Yeah, it did. Yeah, but not that much. But. It's still that rancid smell. Look, it's it like is. A, it is. Look, 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 look. look at this. Just... Hold on, look, 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 look. You're not looking. <sighs> it's everywhere. That's pee too, by the way. It's oh, right here. That's yeah, cool. This is going to be the... Alright guys, that was intense. She pooped all over her clothes, her back, everything. God, I had um, I brought some baby wash, so I kind of took her like a quick shower underneath the sink. Yeah. So guys, advice if you have a baby who just started solids, pack like a hundred clothes, pack a towel, pack shower, um, bath, whatever because it was everywhere. And in the bathroom, it looked like there was no um, AC. Oh, thank you. There was no AC, so I was sweating. Sweating bullets. Do you have something to say? Victoria. What do you have to say for yourself? Huh? Yeah, she thought it was funny. It was not. Guys, I don't even know why we're here now. <laughs> but we'll continue. I haven't found anything yet, so, because we actually just, I didn't even finish my food. We got, we went to get something to eat. I had, and then he, my husband noticed the poop and I had to get up and, like, and just go change it. And now everybody's looking at me with this camera. So guys, I'll talk to you later. All right guys, we are out. I felt like today's mall visit was a mission. First with our poopy friend over here. And I don't know what's going on at the mall, but it looks like there's no AC anywhere. So every store you went to, I went to H&M, I actually found something. But in the dressing room, I was sweating like, I was like, no, something has to be wrong. So I asked the guys, I'm leaving, I'm like, something wrong with the AC because I'm like sweating. Like I feel like I have, I'm going through, um, what is it called, hot, the hot flashes. <laughs> it was intense guys, so yeah, so we just left. We just got what we needed and we're out. Victoria's sleeping. All that poopy <laughs> clothes. It's a disaster, guys. Disaster. Tomorrow we have a busy day. It's my mom's birthday. And she's having a party, so and I'm in charge of the of the um, cake. So I have to go pick it up. Got my baby. She's the cutest little baby ever. All right, guys. Kind of wanted to talk about um. I haven't been blogging, like daily blogging, these couple days. And the reason why is if you guys didn't um, watch my last video where I was um, talking about Victoria's first time eating solids, I talked about how last week um, she was going through a growth spurt. At first, I thought it was a food, so I kind of stopped. And then 
it only lasted like three days and it was really bad one night she woke up at 12 uh, midnight another night she woke up at 3 and then I think another night she woke up 4 in the morning and I didn't know what was going on I'm like uh, what is this like I felt I couldn't sleep you know obviously I was like waking up and then I'm like she doesn't really eat at this time so I didn't want to feed her but eventually I had to give her a bottle so what happens um, from what I read what happens during those spurts that they have is that they kind of go backwards with sleep like if you have them on a sleeping plan they might this is the worst girl spurt apparently and that is why a lot of sleep coaches don't start sleep training till about four after their turn four months and that I guess that's the reason because a lot of babies will go back to their previous um, you know routine and others just good luck guys others just just get out of whack with the whole schedule and obviously because of the spurt they want to eat more so that's why they're waking up in the middle of the, um, of the night more than before so I was praying I was like Lord please let this just go away let me not you know get the scenario where they go out of whack and I have to start from you know from scratch basically because I it took me a while to get her not a while she was pretty good at, I started very early so I think that's what helped but um I was like please she's been sleeping good she has her bedtime eight o'clock she goes to sleep um, by herself I don't have to soothe her I don't have to you know carry her or you know or anything like that I put her in the crib and she goes to sleep so I was really pray praying for that to like stop so it lasted three days and she was fine and then actually she's sleeping even better than before after the growth spurt stopped She's been sleeping 11 to 11 and a half hours straight on without waking up. And she, about what, this, no, last week, I think. Yeah, last weekend that my mother-in-law was uh, took care of her or, um, on Saturday. She told us, she's like, oh, she's pretty good. Like, she grabs her pacifier and she puts it, you know, to her mouth by herself. I didn't realize that until, until she said it. So now, before she used to wake up because she was looking her her pacifier but now she actually got the hang of like grabbing it and we have the woven up which is the pacifier with the little stuffed animal so now she just grabs it and puts it back in her mouth and she goes back to sleep so I don't even have to like go back and like she's been awesome and then so from that you know I just been trying to like cook for her and um what else I'd say trying to go to the gym which has been with the whole schedule thing and her waking up and me being like you know tired I kind of missed the gym a couple of days I'm trying to get back on it by the way guys this is this is the app that I use it's called baby tracker and it looks like this when she was born I used to track even her diapers because obviously you want to make sure that they you know they're going to the bathroom and stuff like that and you could track um, what time they eat if they're eating formula or if they're breastfeeding how many how long they are in each breast or whatnot I love this app so I basically just use it for her food and her sleep I track her food and sleep on, on, the, on this app the other stuff I don't track anymore like diapers and stuff I mean as long as I know she's going to the bathroom as you can tell very regularly so I don't need to track that so yeah guys we're gonna probably just go home and watch some UFC and try to get everything ready for tomorrow because we have a long day tomorrow we're gonna be driving over an hour to the parties and I have to have my mom set up so I'm gonna vlog and you guys see um, tomorrow's celebration so yeah Hi guys, it's Sunday, Sunday fun day, it's around 2, no, 3 o'clock, kind of late, we're on our way to my mom's birthday party which starts at 3, and like always we're late, I woke up super early today, to, well not super early, I woke up like around 9 o'clock, and I had a lot of things to do, I had to get her stuff ready because we're going to be out for a while, 
I had to go pick up my mom's cake because I was in charge of the cake and I also got her some cupcakes. So I had to go pick that up. I had to go stop at the store. It was just up and down and trying to get ready and then she woke up as I was getting ready so I literally had to like hold, like carry her because she had to eat. So I wanted to feed her when we got into the car. That did not work out. We were late so I ended up feeding her before we left the house. It's just been a struggle guys but I'm so happy because it's my mom's birthday and I love her so much. She does so much things for me and you know she's always been there for me so I'm gonna go celebrate and party. It's kinda, it was supposed to rain today but it looks like it's kind of cloudy but looks like it's going to not rain thank god because it's an outside party. We arrived after two hours. I can't even see you. Two this, hours this they is, took. This is my brother, my older. No, he's my middle one, and this is the little one. Who's this for? The blog. Oh, this for the uh, blog. Oh. Yeah, I'm a blogger now. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> my little brother that lives in Orlando. He's so little, right? No. Is he single? Are you single? Ready to mingle? Go ready to mango, guys. All right, you got the. Oh, you want me to get this? No, because we got the cake. Oh. I'll come back to that. Mommy! Yeah. <laughs> Happy birthday! Oh. <laughs> I love you. Love you. Love you. Love you. See? Oh, okay. Hello. Ha comido, está comiendo. Hello. Hola. Hola, hola. Hola. Nice to meet you. Muy bueno. Paula. Nice to meet you. Where's the pork? Let me see. Right here. Oh my goodness. She was breathing yesterday. Does that have me? She said she was breathing. Fresh. Hi, baby. It's a party. It's my baby. Yeah. A little ride. Fun okay. stuff, you know. You want to go on the hammock? <laughs> yeah, go on the hammock. Yeah, I'll go, go, baby. <laughs> then he won't be able to get up. Let's go like this all the time. Oh, there, you could go like that. <laughs> why do you want me to go so bad? <laughs> she got herself. I'm gonna go see the, the cake. Water. 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 Introduce yourself Are you a and say, yes. Myself? Hi. <laughs> Pretty and face. Subscribe. Tell you all your friends to subscribe. <laughs> this is my cousin, Mele. This is my first roommate. Yes. We went through a lot. We had such a good time. We used to party every day, every weekend. We oh, it was a routine. What was it? Beach. Beach on beach on Saturday. No way. Beach no. all every weekend. Yeah. It was love Friday night, beach on the Saturday morning, love at night, beach Sunday morning, and club at night too. So I don't know. Every, oh my god, I don't know how we did it, but we club every weekend. First roommate. First roommate. <laughs> she was last the roommate in the last. In the last one. <laughs> this is my roommate now. <laughs> it's her new roommate. Look at her new roommate. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, do you have something to say? I have to say that I have the most beautiful 
sister in the world and I love her. This is like my first child. I took care of him when he was talk a about diaper. Poopers, then I'll talk about something else. <laughs> Did you subscribe? Yes. Yes. Any words about La Serenata? How in the world did he do that? I came in with the halfway. No, you didn't. Alright guys, I'm back, but not for long. Just got home, well not just got home, but it was pouring when we got here. So we had to like run into the house, I got completely wet. I had to put Victoria to sleep, feed her and put her to sleep and took a shower because like I said, I got wet. I hope you guys had as much fun as I did. I had so much fun today with family and friends and we danced, we party, we celebrated my mom's birthday. We had an awesome time and now it's time for bed. I'm extremely tired. It's been a long day. So... I'm going to bed. I hope you guys liked this video. If you did, press the like button and please subscribe if you haven't done so already. And uh, till next time, bye.